Hi everyone, welcome back to my YouTube channel and today I will show you how to create a digital art in Canva. Go to Canva and then choose print and then I will choose flyer size. First I will add a circle and go to frame. So I will add this circle frame here in the center and then I will type here watercolor forest. You can choose any element here that watercolor type. For example, I will choose this one. I will insert it to the circle. Now let's modify this image. First, I will add watercolor cloud on the graphic. I will find the white one. Let's see this one. It's too dark. I will use this one. Okay. Press your control button to avoid it inserted to the frame. I will duplicate to make it more white. Okay. And then I will add element here and here, that, which is trees. So I will type here tree, watercolor tree. I will add this one I'll place it here so there is some pop out element on this digital art and then I will add more three I will add this one reduce the size and I will place it here and then I will add something to hide this bottom part of the tree so I will add these trees watercolor pine i will reduce the size and i will place it here and also duplicate reduce the size to be placed here and then i will add a watercolor element and i think it's a bird let's scroll down i think this one is the best a parrot okay reduce the size and i will place it here rotate a little i'll go to position layers and i will place it behind the tree and then i will add another cloud but not white i will choose this one I will move it here and I will send it behind the bird the parrot I mean all right I think I should reduce the transparency a little okay now I will add watercolor birds I will choose this one And then this one here. Now let's add a paint splash effect here. I mean paint splash element. I will add here paint drip. Enter. First I will use this one. And then I will change the color to click this color button. Click this plus button. Click this color picker. I will use this color, the color of these trees, and then I will increase the size, and I will send it to back. Okay, now I will add another fan drip element. On the graphic, I will choose this one. Okay, and then I will change the color to the same color. This one, and I'll reduce the size. I'll place it here. So it covers the circle. And then duplicate. Flip horizontal. I'll place it here. And then back to paint drip and i will find this 
one change the color to the same color as the other drip i'll place it here increase the size okay and then send it to back i will move it to the top a little okay and then go to position layers and i will copy this pen drip element and duplicate it and reduce the size to be placed here. Duplicate again. I'll place it here and a little more here. All right, and then select them all. I will slide it to the right a little to make it balance. Okay, and then you can change the background to canvas style on the photos, like. This one maybe, set image as background, and then click share, download, and you can download it as PNG or as PDF for print. So this is the tutorial, I hope you like it, and feel free to share your result to my Facebook, Reno Nadiandi, and see you next video, have fun with Canva.